Hey babies, I'm back on a new video. Hey babies, I'm back with a new video and today's video is going to be a hair tutorial on this two slick down ponytails and if you want to achieve this look, continue to watch the video but before I, let I start this video, like and subscribe, all the good stuff you done away, tears you done away, do! And let's get into hey this video. Hey babies, so I just come from taking out my hair but before I start, you will need a couple of scrunchies or hair ties. You will also need a comb and a wave brush to smoothen out your hair. You will also need a brush to detangle your hair and a toothbrush for your edges. You will also need pins and you will also need gel. You could use any type of gel you have in your house, but Eco Style is the best gel that holds my hair. You will also need weave. It could be new or old. You could use whatever you have in your house. So basically right now, I'm going to untangle my hair. So right now I'm going to part it like in a curve like style but if you like you can put it straight but I rather it in a curve. So now I'm going to tie up the side of the head that has the most hair because it's easier to do the side that doesn't have so much hair and then untangle it again because it might get tangled up like how my zone does. Now you get your gel and apply gel all over the top, bottom, side. You don't know where it is. You don't know where it do. Just put it all over your head. Just make sure you got enough. Put it on your edges, the bottom, the side, the top. So now get your wave brush and smoothen it out. So like when you tie it up, it'll be like a smooth, pretty, you know, a smooth, slick down ponytail. Get your two scrunchies and tie your hair as tight as you can. I recommend you to use two scrunchies because of the fact that it's going to hold your hair much better than one scrunchie. So basically right now I took out the rest of my hair and I'm going to part it like in a side since that side has more hair than the other side you have to apply more gel. Now you get your wave brush to smoothen it out. If necessary, you can apply more gel for more holdage. So right now I'm going to tie my hair so I could smoothen out the top. Now you twist both sides of your hair and put it in a little bun. So now you apply more gel so you could do your edges and you're going to pick up the comb and swoop it to the side. Mm -hmm. 
now you're gonna use your prick toothbrush to smooth it out all the lumps and hard you know hair that's tangled up So on this side, I don't really do much on this side. I don't really know why, but I'm gonna do it this time because I have a lot of baby hairs. So I'm gonna just swoop it to the side and take out some hair to the side. So now I'm gonna apply more gel and like smoothen it out again because my hair tends to curl. So since I can't find my hair tie, I'm going to use a shirt. You can also use a shirt if you cannot find your hair tie to lay down your edges. And leave that on for at least 10 minutes. It's dry. Now you can apply the weave to your hair. So basically, I doubled the hair so it could go way faster. So basically, I'm going to take one part of the hair and pin it down. So I could wrap around the weave as tight as I can. You might have to use the other pin in your hair because you might feel like it's loose so you can use the other pin. And when you're finished, just continue to do this process by wrapping your hair around. So when you reach to the end of the hair, just pin it down. So when you're done untangling your hair, when you look, you can see the track. So you would want to take a piece, a little piece of the bottom of your hair so you could wrap it around so it could look like way more professional use a pin to pin down the the extra hair that's left out so now you're going to continue this process on the other side of your hair Now you're finished and you look slay, girl. You look bad. <laughs> Hi, babies. Thank you guys for watching. Black John got it. Black John got it. Right, right.